Hi guys, it's Will from Spire. Today I'm going to be lifting our very own Crafter camper van um, using 40 millimeter lifting blocks as we've got here. Um, hope you enjoy. First of all, to start off, we're going to remove the wheels. going to start off on the rear and I'm going to remove the drop links um, and the front shock absorber bolt using a transition stand to support the weight so I can lower it down to put the block in. Now we've removed the drop links and the shock absorber bolts, we've managed to undo the U-clamps or the U-bolts, let's say, to drop the axle to put the blocks in. So that's the rear done. Um, the blocks are in place, the lifting blocks are all in place. Everything's tightened back up and greased when it went back together. Let's move on to the front. So now the rear is done, we're on to the front. Uh, for this one now, you're gonna have to undo the two bolts going through the strut and the hub, um, the drop link and the three top mount bolts up under the bonnet. So at the minute, we're removing one of the main fuse boxes um, just to give me more access or easier access, I say, to get to the top mount bolts. kit we've been supplied we've got to change the studs to go out through the strut tower so what we've had to do is I've had to take the top mount off obviously leaving the spring and the spring compressor with the chain around it and the shock absorber on the floor and I'm gonna to have to move these out and put the new ones in right so now we've changed the studs we hammered the old ones out um, hammered the new ones in make sure you don't damage the face of the top mount um, you could change them, but in this case, the van's brand new, so it doesn't really need changing. Um, but yeah, there we go. Right, that's one side done, let's move on to the other. So same, same again this side, we're gonna undo the two strut bolts, the drop link that I've already took out, and then we're gonna have to undo the three top mount bolts, and that strut assembly should pull out. So we just got to, we managed to struggle, me and James have both tackled it to get it back in. Um, was a bit of a struggle, but we got there. Just finally got to double check the cool these are tight, finished it, doing the drop link up and the top mount bolts, and we're done. It's been a few weeks since we fitted the lift kit to the crafter. Many things have been done since, but one obvious thing is the plastic wheel arch covers. And finally, yes, the new wheels have arrived. Let's get them on and fitted. The wheels fitted these are black rhino arsenal wheels and they're 17 inch and they're wrapped in the bf goodrich ko2 tires so now we're pretty much done on the exterior of the crafter that includes the light bar the ball bars the lift kit and the alloy wheels thanks for watching guys like comment and subscribe and let us know what you want to see next